confirm the existence of a dagger strength goal? Um, probably. I mean, makes sense. But yeah, and I was just in the right spot at the right time. When he made a great play in short C, you know, put on that, just try to get there and try to get the rebound. We're gonna lose a feel for you guys to be able now to go in front of your home fans and, and, and wrap this thing up. Um, you know, they're a good team. They're not gonna they're not gonna go away easily. So, um, you know, it's, we have a chance to do it at home. I think we're gonna come out. We're gonna have our crowd behind us and and uh, you know just try to play the game that that we've been growing into and and uh, you know be solid at both ends of the rink. So, what was it like that last few minutes? It well, was stressful. I wasn't even out there. It was harder to watch, honestly, probably. But um, it was awesome. Our guys did great, obviously. Um, you know, we couldn't put it away, get the empty netter. But I thought our team team did great in, in uh, you know, not shying away from anything and, and being aggressive still. So, um, you know, they got great players over there. So we're just trying to take time and space away. And I think we did a good job of that tonight. It's the fifth straight game that you guys have scored the first goal. It took a little longer today. But, but what, what, what were you guys doing so effectively besides the time and space just, just strategically against them? Uh, you know, I think just sticking to our game plan, um, you know, it's a long series, you know, we're getting towards the end of it here. Obviously, we've got two games left, so, um, yeah, nothing really. I think we got a lot of big bodies. We got we like to play down low, so I think it's about, you know, keeping possession of pucks and trying not to throw things away. We know we, they got good players that, you know, can turn things around in an instant, and they've shown us they can do that, so just try to limit that and, and uh, you know, stick to our game. How tough is it for you guys to play the aggressive style that you do w without taking penalties? It's kind of a fine line between the, between the two. You want to say something, Brandon? Okay. Um, yeah, for sure it's fine line. I think, you know, there's the illusion that you get a lot away with a lot more in, in playoffs, but I think, um, you know, you've seen that. Obviously, we, we uh, had a penalty tonight, but, uh, you know, our kill's been awesome. So, um, it's good. Obviously, there's a fine line. I think we got some guys that, that know how to play that line and, and just be careful. So, um, yeah, we're just trying to go out there and, and play the same way we've been, been doing all year and, and, you know, try to keep having the success we're, we're having. Hi, Crunchier's goal. What, is, what was the reaction like for you guys to see player enter the game for the first time, play a game, take his first shot to make it? Yeah, it's great. Um, obviously, it's a big moment, um, big goal for us. You know, go up to 2-1 two, there is a good response goal. So, yeah, he's been awesome. He fit right in. and. And uh, with Maddie and Ebb, so you know we're not expecting him to do that by any means, and we're uh, we're just trying to make him go out there or have him go out there and, and play a solid game. I think he did that tonight, and and uh, you know he's in the right place, at the right time. Ebb's made a great play, and and you know he put it away with authority. So not much more you can ask for.